Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. If you're new around here, hi I'm Madeline and I'm so happy that you are here today. Today's video is going to be a what I eat in a day and I'm also going to add like my workouts into that as well. I did a poll on my Instagram story. If you don't follow me on Instagram, go ahead and do that. It is down below in the description. I did a poll on if you guys would want to see this kind of video and I think it was like 95% yes. So here I am. I don't know how to describe my diet honestly. I feel like I'm pretty healthy, but at the same time, like, I'm not, like, super, super healthy. Um, I don't really restrict myself on anything except gluten. I'm gluten intolerant, but I don't restrict myself from gluten by choice. I just try to make sure that I'm active and I eat what I want. <laughs> so I don't know if what I'm eating is necessarily healthy, the best for me, whatever. I don't eat bad at all, really. I'm not a nutritionist. I don't have any degree certification in nutrition. This video is just popular. I love watching these kinds of videos. I think that they're fun and interesting. I like seeing what people eat. I like getting like meal ideas from them as well because I am in college. Well, I'm home right now. I'm about to move back to school in a couple weeks and I do cook for myself there. So it is nice to get meal ideas from these kinds of videos. So I really do enjoy watching them and I'm really excited to make my own. I already recorded myself making breakfast. I had an egg sandwich on a bagel thin. I showed the ingredients and like me making it and everything in the video. And I also had a banana, an iced coffee and a water. to drink this bagel water throughout the day it is where is it 3,000 milliliters which I believe is equivalent to like three-fourths of a gallon so I will have like a glass of water with my meals but then I try to drink this big guy throughout the day I think I'm going to do my first workout of the day while I was like brushing my teeth and stuff I kept debating on what I was gonna do for my workout but I think it's 34 degrees outside that is pretty chilly. I think for my cardio, I'm gonna take the dog on a walk outside because she is absolutely nuts and she needs to be walked every day or she is crazy. For those of you that maybe this is like your first video of mine or if you don't know, um, we have a five, almost five and a half month old Bernie Doodle and she's about 50 pounds so she's pretty big for a puppy and she is just full of energy all the time. Um, we take her on a walk and she naps for maybe like an hour and then she is just crazy again. We try to walk her around three miles every day if we can. Obviously, um, I live in Indiana, so sometimes the weather doesn't always allow us to walk her that much, but we try to. Walking is really good for you. I love walking, so we're going to walk her today. But first, I think I'm going to go down and do 30 minutes of weightlifting. I'm going to do lower body today. Um, basically what I do is, um, I'm going to show you guys when I get down there. I have like a, a mini gym in my basement kind of. We don't have a lot of stuff, but we have like basic equipment. So that's what I've been doing since I've been home. I'll come up with like six or seven different exercises and then I will just go through them as many times as I can in 30 minutes. And that is my workout. Hi Winnie, you want to say hi to the video? Can you sit? Can you shake my hand? Good girl, so smart.
first round took me like seven and a half minutes. I'll get through about four of those. So, wish me luck. <laughs> okay, so I just finished my leg day workout. I ended up getting through three sets and then I played a song and just kind of did for like each, I think I did two sets of, two counts of eight and just did whatever exercise, like I did jumping jacks for one, squats, sumo squats, glute bridges, a bunch of different stuff. And so I ended up taking 33 minutes, burned 260 calories, active calories, 310 total calories, average heart rate was 149. And so now for workout number two, me and my brother are gonna take Winnie on a walk. We're gonna go ahead and do that and then I will give you the stats from that workout. We just got back from Winnie's walk not too long ago. We walked 2.4 miles, so almost two and a half. It took us 48 minutes, burned 217 active calories, 291 total calories. Average heart rate was 128, elevation gain was 69 feet. And I'm just gonna make coffee number two for today. I do make like a full pot in the morning and I just drink on it throughout the day. I'm gonna make it the same way with the half and half that I showed you earlier and my skinny syrup. I've been really liking glazed donut. It literally tastes like the glaze off of a donut, which like you would think, well, no doubt, like that's the name of it, but like literally. The half and half that I use is just from Great Value. This is actually my mom's, um, sorry mom. I'm gonna make my next coffee, get some stuff done around the house and then I will talk to you guys when it is lunchtime. It is. 11:40, and it is time for lunch um my mom and i actually meal prepped this week and we made some stir fry it looks gross but it's so yummy it has um chicken sausage it is from that one organic brand that's at kroger i can't think of what it's called right now but we got the spinach chicken sausage rice cauliflower and then a pack of stir fry it's not like a frozen kind that comes in a bag it's in like the produce section of kroger and it is so so yummy <laughs> I just finished my lunch and I am so full. That is so filling and it's so yummy. It's time to pack my snacks for work now. I just packed some roasted red pepper hummus with some gluten-free pretzels. This is the Snyder's brand. I was so excited when I found these in gluten-free. And then I pack a string cheese and then two Dove chocolates because it's all about balance. I'm honestly probably gonna make another coffee before I go to work. I leave in about 40 minutes. And then um, I do have my cup of water. I usually drink about two of these while I'm at work. So it is now time for dinner. Mom made some meatloaf. This is one of my favorite things. I love meatloaf. If you don't like meatloaf, grow up. She made some gluten-free mac and cheese. This stuff is so good. This is the Kraft brand. I was so excited when I found this. It's so yummy. And then we have some mashed potatoes right here. She also made broccoli, which I did not see before, but yeah. <laughs> It has been a hot, hot minute. My makeup is like wiped off from my mouth, but it's whatever. But I went to a basketball game to watch my little cousin cheer. My Nana gave me a mini Tootsie Pop sucker, so I ate that. But mom and I are gonna eat some ice cream. This is like, I just think it's funny that we decided to do this on the day I'm filming this video of what I eat. Um, I have ice cream literally like once a month like i rarely rarely ever really eat desserts at all but you know what it's all about balance so we're gonna go make some ice cream <music> a string cheese like right now this is like my favorite go-to snack is cheese 
I am about to take a bath and then go ahead and head on to bed. So I think I am done eating for today. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope this was interesting. I don't know. I like these kinds of videos. I feel like I eat pretty like average. I don't know. I don't know. I don't eat super unhealthy, but I also don't eat like... So I feel like I just eat like any average person would. I don't know. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Leave a comment down below and subscribe to my channel. And make sure that you hit the notification bell so that you won't miss an upload from me.